Okay, welcome back guys. We're going to be solving another question in today's video and we have problem 66 from the second chapter of Miriam textbook and we have this upper hinge A of the uniform cabinet door that has malfunction and causing the entire rate of the five kilogram door to be carried by the lower hinge B. So we have the mass of the door and from that we can obviously find the weight which we know weight is equal to mass times acceleration of gravity or g which we know is 9.81 meter per square second on earth and we need to determine the couple associated with these two forces and we have a note at the end of this question that we may neglect this light offset from the edge of the cabinet door to the hinge center line and the reason is that so realistically if the angle is too much we're gonna see the door turning something like this and the reason is that for finding the couple so let's go over to uh, the definition of couple before we get into this note at the end of this question so the moment that is produced by two forces that are equal which we know they are both mg they are in the opposite direction one of them is upward the other one is downward and they are non-collinear meaning they are not in the same line as we can see they are parallel and one of them is actually um, above the other one and as we can see all we have all of these three characteristics in these two forces in here so the moment that we're going to find or the couple that is produced by these two forces is basically f times d f is our force and d is the distance between these two forces which is what we have in here so the rest of this question is not hard at all we basically have to find the force which is the weight and the distance is pretty easy we know the length of this side is 600 meter so technically 600 divided by 2 is 300 which is our d but let's get back to the note that we saw at the end of the question and uh, the question is saying that we can neglect this light offset from the edge of the cabinet so as i was saying if that offset is too much uh, so we're gonna see something like this that the door is shifting a little bit to the right and if that's the case uh, we are interested to find this D it won't be as simple as as simple as 600 divided by 2 and the reason the question is asking the question is saying we can neglect that is that uh, we can find the D pretty easy by uh, basically dividing the 600 by 2 since we are neglecting the offset of the door because of the weight so let's just figure out the weight so finding the weight or our force is mass which is five kilogram times g that's going to give us a newton force and the distance that we have in here is based on millimeter so basically we have 300 or 600 divided by 2 which is 300 millimeter we're going to divide it by a thousand in order to get it in a meter and we have our force in newton and at the end we can find our moment 14.72 newton meter but the question is not over we have to show the direction of the moment so as always we're going to call the counterclockwise moment positive and if we look at the couple that is produced by these two we can see that the door is going to turn in this direction which is a clockwise direction so we have a negative sign in here and here and at the end we're going to write it down clockwise and that would be the couple associated with these two forces and the final answer for this question so yeah i hope you guys find this helpful let me know if you have any questions uh, regarding this one or the three textbooks that we are covering in this channel feel free to check out the playlist the question are organized by the textbook and you can see them in order of the chapters and the question number in the playlist so don't forget to subscribe to the channel like and comment it's going to help me to reach out to more students and you guys take care i'll see you in the next video have a good one mm -hmm.